y'all it's your boy Tay and we coming at y'all with another video today well our first video can't say another one because this is our first one but today we're going to be doing a prank what we're doing is um i'm gonna call random companies papa john's whoever i'm gonna just call them and i'm gonna impersonate a celebrity on the phone with them and see how long they can last i'm gonna see how long their patience is with customers because customer service is first right ain't that right that's what they say so what we're gonna do is i'm gonna call random numbers and i'm gonna just act like a celebrity um you know and um see what see i can get them to react see how mad i can make these people man see how mad i can make them so i need you to like subscribe to the channel and also leave in the comments who y'all want me to do i mean i can call some y'all family people and prank them or whatever like that but we're gonna go ahead and get into it man let's go right, y'all first person i'm gonna call is dairy queen here's the number right here so y'all know it ain't nothing crazy nothing fake hold on let me let the joint focus in all right i'm gonna call dairy queen first i'm gonna act like chris sales looking for queen all right here we go let me see the answer Hi, how y'all doing today? Fine. Good. Hey, I got a quick question for y'all. I was wondering, uh -huh. um, what kind of um ice cream do y'all have? Soft serve. Soft serve. Okay. Does like Queen make it? It comes from a dairy. Does well, it come like from like Queen's dairy? I don't know. It comes from. It's, it's a soft serve mix that we hook up to a machine. Oh, okay. So, like, do y'all like? So, y'all make it, make it? Cause, like, my qu my question is like, I I came to Dairy Queen yesterday with Queen, and my stomach was hurting like real, real bad. Uh huh. And so, um, I was wondering like, because I think I'm lactose intolerant, but you know, I, I don't know if Queen make it or made it or what, but it messed my stomach up like really, really bad. Okay. Well, if you're lactose intolerant, it is a dairy product, so. Uh, it, it has milk in it. It comes from a dairy. Oh, okay. I thought it was like a uh, Queen's product. That's the reason I really, I, I chanced it. And no, it's, 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 it's milk. I mean, it's made with dairy. Oh, okay. Dairy Queen. Oh, so it's not just Queen. It's Dairy no, Queen. No, we're called Dairy Queen. Oh, okay. Got you. Um... All right, well, can I talk to Queen? Bruh. <laughs> Yo, y'all, she got so mad. All right, we're going to go ahead and go to the next one. That one was straight. Like, she lasted, um, she actually lasted two minutes. That's pretty good. All right, we're going to go to the next one, y'all. We're going to call somebody next. Next, y'all, we are going to try to call McDonald's. We all know McDonald's customer service ain't all that great anyway. You know what I'm saying? We already know that service is always not on no Chick-fil-A type of service. So we're going to call them and see how long they can last. I can best bet McDonald's only lasts about, uh, I would say about, probably not even a minute. You know, but let's give it a try. Let's call them right now and see. Okay, let's see. Let's see how long we last. This time I'm gonna act like Jay. Hey, Can I help you? Yeah. Um, I was wondering um about a burger that y'all gave me the other day. Okay. Um, it it it, it had just the bun on it and no patty. Yeah. Did you call back? Um, I didn't. I spoke to the manager, but the manager said to call back today because she wasn't going to be here today. Sure. Yeah. He said what, honey? I said the manager yesterday told me to call back today because she wasn't going to be here. So she told me to call back today. When did you come through? Um, I came through about 5 o'clock on the dot yesterday around evening time. Do you have your receipt from yesterday? 
Yeah, I got my receipt. Um, I think I left it in the bag. I don't know if I threw it away because um, I, I really don't keep it. I have it. to have the receipt, honey, before I can replace something. Okay, uh, I, ha I have the receipt right here. Can I read off what I had? Mm -hmm. um, I had a Big Mac. It almost gave me a heart attack. I had a French fry. It almost gave me um, uh, a uh, bad experience. Yeah. Okay, I'm sorry that you're having issues, but you need to not be playing on the phone, okay? I'm not playing on the phone. I had an order yesterday. <laughs> I told y'all, bro. McDonald's customer service is always, they're always mad. So, I knew that wasn't going to last long. That honestly lasted, let's see, um, two minutes. Two minutes. That was good. That was good. All right, we're going to the next one. All right, y'all. McDonald's was terrible. Uh, one minute flat. We're going to call Walgreens. I don't know if y'all know Ricky Smiley, but Ricky Smiley is the GOAT of prank calls. The GOAT. So... I might not sound just like him, I might not be just like him, but I'm going to wing it just like him, okay? I'm going to call Walgreens and I'm going to act like Bernice Jenkins, okay? I'm going to act like Bernice Jenkins. If y'all not familiar with that, go to his page and look up Bernice Jenkins and y'all will know what I'm talking about. So let's get to it, man. We're going to call Walgreens and I'm going to just wing it. I'm going to just go with it. I'm going to just go with Hi, it. Hi, thanks for calling Walgreens at the southeast corner of Williamson Road and Hirschberger Road in Roanoke. Para continuar en español, oprima nueve. No, ¿cómo puedo ayudarte hoy? Customer service. You want to talk to an agent, right? Yes, ma'am. Or a sir. And what do you want to talk to them about? Uh, about, about some uh, products. I'll just need a little more information so I can get you what you need. If you're calling about a prescription, or if you have any questions for the pharmacy, press 1. For the photo department, press 2. For the cosmetics department, press 3. Let's go to the photo department. department. Okay, I can get someone to help you. Before I transfer you, I just have a quick question about your experience using the automated system today. Oh, yeah. Using a scale from 1 to 5, where 1 is not at all satisfied, and 5 is extremely satisfied, how satisfied were you with your overall experience? 4. Thanks for your feedback. I'm connecting you now. Just so you know, the store is open till midnight tonight, and tomorrow they're open from 8 a.m. to midnight. doing today, sugar? I'm uh, doing well. How are you today? Blessed and highly favored. Yes, I am. Uh, quick question for you. What time does the uh, uh, the uh, the photo department close today? It closes at 12. Well, to God be the glory for all the things he has done. I have some pictures of my grandbabies that I need to get developed. Um, And I was wondering how long would that about take there to get them developed? Depends on how many, and if we have to crop any. If it's just a few, it shouldn't take more than five or ten minutes. Okay, well, my, my, it may take some cropping because one of my grandbabies' head is so big in one of the pictures to where you got it. One of them tall, one of them short. So, is that possible to maybe do some shot photo on his head to bring it down a couple of sizes? We would have to see it to know what to do with it, I'm afraid. Okay, that boy got a lot to see. I know that's for a fact, sugar. But, uh, but how much would it take to window uh, something like that? There's 36, 36 by 12, and then 
Okay, 39 cents for a 4x6 and 3.99 for a 5x7 or up. Okay, well that boy got about a 5 by 7 head. So we need to go up to about like a 7 by, by, by about 4 by 8 or so like that. Because that's going to take a lot of rendering now. Okay, well we'll just see you when you come in and we'll take a look at them. Well, God bless you. Sir. You're so sweet. I appreciate your help. Okay, but we'll see you in a little bit. All right, God bless you. Okay, bye-bye. Bye-bye now. That didn't go bad. That did not go bad. Her customer service, great. Because me, if I was working there, I'm like, oh, lady, look. Your grandson's head, done for. You know, done. Don't don't come here. She was good. Old lady to uh, Walgreens. On to the next one though. Let's go. All right, y'all. We're going to call Chipotle. We're going to call him and I'm going to act like 50 Cent. We all know 50. We all know 50 is, you know, constantly, you know, he's the Instagram thing. You know, that's my guy to go to when I want to laugh because he always in somebody's pockets. So I'm going to call Chipotle and I'm going to do the same thing. Let's see. Here we go. Make sure y'all see that. That is Chipotle. Let's give him a call. Let's give him a call. Here we go. Hey, how you doing today? My name's Curtis. Um, I was wondering about uh, one of y'all's bowls that y'all got down there. I'm sorry? I was wondering about one of the bowls y'all got down there. The bowls? Okay. Yeah. And uh, I got a bowl yesterday, and uh, after I ate it, I needed some, it, it owed me some money. Owed you some money for what? For the, uh, for the, for the, uh, I think I, I called the manager yesterday, and she said uh, that I could get a refund on it, because, uh. Okay, if you're getting a refund, you have to come back to the store. That's a long drive. I can't make it that far. That's the only way we can do the refund. Yeah, I don't have, like, cash up or nothing like that? PayPal. I'm sorry? Yeah, I have like PayPal, Venmo, Zip. No, sir, we can only refund it if you come into the store. Oh, that's a long drive right there. Um, so if I, if I bring my receipt back and I can get, I can get my money, because like yes, I'm, I'm tired of people owe me money, I ain't getting it. Yes, sir, if you bring your receipt back, we can refund your money. Okay, do you know my name? Curtis? Yeah, Curtis Jackson. Okay. Yeah, so what, what time do you close today? Okay, well, I think I'm gonna come out there later on and get my money. Okay. Alright, have a good day. You too. <laughs> I couldn't keep my composure on that one, bro. I could not keep my composure. Yo, that was good. That was good. Alright, y'all. So, what we gonna do now? I'm gonna call this Chinese play right here. And I'm gonna act like Chris Brown ordering food okay let's see how this goes let's see if they even answer the phone like my early right now so let's see if they even answer the phone let's see hey how you doing um how much would it cost do you deliver right now how much is it uh just for like five i need like five orders uh, I pick them up, that's cool, but can I like place them over the phone and then come pick them up, or do I got like... Uh, you have all the call information, just you can pay for the phone, that's the phone. So I can pay for it over the phone, and then I can come pick it up? Yeah, that's fine. As long as you have all call information, just you know. You sure? So, like, what about, so what if I place like 10 orders? I want to place like 10, 15, 20 orders? Can I do it that way and then do it the same way? Or is it like a bulk uh, like type of food or thing going on that I got going on? Do y'all got any specials? We got lunch special. How much is the lunch special? Alright, which, which one are you, you going to get? Uh, I... The average is from like $5.99 to $6.59. Yeah. That's not, that's not that bad for real. I can run that. That's cool. Um, so do y'all like... 
what do you get for this like six ninety nine? Sorry? What do you get for like the six ninety nine? I mean what not special you like you like them like Jonathan, Keith and Borg they all have different points. I they just say the the range is I got I like Really, really, I like any food that ain't got no guidance to it, for real. So, like, uh, anything, for real, like, uh, General Souls, General Souls really be popping. And, uh, I like the, uh, the shrimp fried rice. I would suggest you just stop by the restaurant and take a peek on the menu. And this way you get a better idea which one, which dish you're gonna get. That's cool. Do, 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 do. That's fine. I can do that. What time y'all, what time y'all close today? 9.30 for lunch uh, at 3 o'clock. Okay, that's heartbreak on the full moon. I could do that. That's cool. All right, well, I'll come by then. Okay. All right, man, run it. Bye-bye. Yeah, he was real patient, bro. I give him a 10. And a applause. Okay. All right, y'all, that will conclude today's video. Make sure y'all like, comment, and subscribe to the channel, bro, where I will be bringing more heat each and every day to y'all, bro. Each and every day, you know? So, subscribe, like, share the page, bro. We gone.